Alright, what's going on guys? Uh, before this video starts, I just wanted to take a second out of it and say thank you to all my subscribers. Uh, we're, at, we're at like 250 right now, which is which is great. Um, I didn't think I would get that many this quick. And the video of me dipping my Veloster uh, has over 7,000 views, so that's awesome too. So, yeah, to all you subscribers, thank you. And welcome to my channel if you're new. Uh, it's this channel is mainly about me dipping cars and working on that piece right there uh, Probably have some friends on here too, you know depending how the channel goes The car has to be washed. Um, I haven't washed it since I dipped it so It's been dipped for maybe I don't know a couple months now So it's been there for a couple months, it's dirty, it needs a wash. <clears throat> and yeah, one of the main questions I get is how do I wash my car, uh, and how do I wash Plasti Dip, so I'll answer that right now. Do any of you guys have this problem with the Veloster? This thing, I don't know, I don't even know what it is. It came loose, it makes a shit ton of noise. And it's not held in by anything, it kind of just gets pushed in place. So, I'm gonna take that off at some point. This one's solid. This one. This one comes off a lot. Mm, look at that. Yummy. Alright, so yeah, back to topic. Uh, so, I'm gonna wash the car. I get a lot of questions on how do I wash my car and what kind of soap I use. So,. Here are the soaps I use. <clears throat> so now that the car is dipped, I use Dip Wash by DipYourCar.com. Blah, blah, blah. So that's what I use to clean the dip. When the car was wrapped, I used this Auto Wash Satin Matte Finish by Chemical Guys. And then I use the matte detailer spray sealant by Chemical Guys. I have a pressure washer. I have a, a foam gun. So this is from... Uh, I think this is either from DipYourCar.com or Chemical Guys. No, that one is from Chemical Guys. This one's from Dip Your Car. So I just put a little bit of water in there. The rest soap. Shake it up. And put it into the pressure washer and spray it on the car so that's how I wash my car I guess all right so everything's hooked up everything's hooked up it's just water going to the pressure washer pressure washer is run by electricity uh, first I first I hose the car down so just rinse it down The rear end is my favorite part. It gets so dirty from all the, the exhaust. So th this is my favorite part here. Just watch all the dirt come off. Now that the car is nice and wet, I'm going to mix this soap. Now I'm going to mix this soap into the, the foam cannon. The pressure washer is kind of broken, that's why it keeps making that noise. Alright, so open this up. I'm going to fill it up to 200 with water. Close 
close enough. Get yourself a funnel. Get yourself your dip wash. And just uh, fill it up to 900. Don't fill it up all the way. Oh shit. Oopsies. You can see how much I really don't care. Clean up your spill. Get rid of that. So, this is how I'm gonna wash the car. So now I'm going to put the dip wash into the pressure washer and I'm going to foam the car. So what I like to do is, once the foam is on, I like to let it sit for you know, a couple seconds, maybe a minute. I'll let all the dirt drip down to the bottom. I'm gonna hose it down again, and then I'm gonna foam it again. And then with the soap on the car, I'm gonna wipe it down. So. If you see I'm busy and I'm doing something, don't be that guy. Like if I'm dipping a car, don't ask me questions. Wait until I'm done. Just don't be that guy. So you get this from dipyourcar.com. What is it? I don't know. It's I have no idea what it is. It's the first time I'm washing my car, but Ignis and my brother have washed their car here before and they use this. I don't know what it is. For all you guys that are at Pro Dip Your Car guys, I have this. Am I going to use it? Fuck no. I'm going to use this. Why? Because I don't care. The dip is coming off after winter. I really don't care about the condition of it, so I'm just going to use this. on the ground. Do I care? Fuck no. I'm still going to use it. Alright, so this is the second round of the, the foaming. This time I am going to scrub around the soap. Alright, so I scrubbed the soap around. I got all the, the stuck on dirt, whatever. So now I'm just gonna hold it down. Again. All right. So the car is all washed. Uh, reason why I use uh, the pole thing instead of the dip your car sponge because I'm a lazy piece of shit and I don't feel like bending over with the sponge and with the pole I don't have to so you know whatever Use my uh am I gonna dry the car probably not uh because I'm too lazy so 
How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Five. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to dry the car off because I'm a lazy piece of shit. So I'm going to put everything away. I'm going to bring the car in the garage. I'm going to vacuum it. Alright, so aftercare for dip wash is pretty easy. Honestly, this stuff is awesome. It's dip coat. Um, it's made for dip cars. You know, if you want to take a second and read that, because I'm not going to read it for you. Okay. But, I mean, all you got to do is lightly, oh shit, lightly spray off the area. I like to spray the rag so I don't go in dry. And just one motion in one direction. I mean, that, that's, this is what I like to do. Don't take this as a professional fucking advice. So, if Bonzi has a different way of doing it, then listen to Bonzi. But, this is how I do it. And that's it. I mean, you just go around the whole car doing this. It makes it really smooth. It smells great. It'll, it'll give you a, a chance to wipe off those spots you missed while washing your car. Because I know I did. But yeah, I just do that around the whole car.